Hello YouTube, Slacker Stacker here, and I've got another trade that came in today, and this is another one that I've been looking forward to. Uh, this one comes from Scully's Corner, and Scully is known for, uh, he's a great pourer. Uh, he, uh, he's known for his, his guns. Uh, I saw a video of his where he has like a Thompson machine gun, AK-47, an M16, uh, several other type of assault rifles, and then he's got a, you know, a whole conglomeration of some pistols and stuff. He, I believe he poured a gold pistol, uh, or was that Bernie? I, I, I'm not sure, but he's got a lot of the weaponry that he's poured, and it's all highly detailed. Um, so he, I asked, I approached him for a trade, and, and he was interested in one of my logo bars. Uh, so I told him, sure, you know, I'll send you a slacker bar. And so he said, well, what do you want of mine? And I said, I want one of those Thompson guns. <laughs> and he was like, you know, I think we can do that. And so uh, we settled the deal, and it is now here. And we will get to it. I went ahead and took it out of the box. Uh, so I, I didn't want to have to unpack all that, and it was it was full. I mean, it was packed well. So anyway, this is what came out of the box. There is a card here that was on the top, and I will open that up. And he uh, here's some things I'll show you here in a second. But Slacker Stacker, thank you for the trade, my friend, and we hope you like the number six Thompson. Looking forward to getting a Dragon Bar when you get it made, Shanny and Scully. Well, the funny thing was, is I still had a few left when we uh, talked about this trade, and you know, it's been kind of how long it's been since we started this. But uh, what's funny is how it worked out. He sent me the number six Thompson that he poured, and I sent him my number six Slacker Bar. So <laughs> the two sixes just passed in the mail stream. So uh, here is the certificate of authenticity there's scully's uh trademark skull uh hand poured silver by scully uh has a bd there is number six item thompson machine gun weight 2.7 ounces troy hand poured silver for your collection made exclusively exclusively by and i want to say bay ridge or or Bay Ridge. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, Scully. Let me know how to pronounce that correctly. But uh, but Bay Ridge designs. Each piece is individually hand poured in triple nine fine silver. And so uh, we're down to the moment. Oh, and he sent me a st again. They're starting to figure out out there that I am a sucker for stickers. I love these things. So uh, thank you, Scully. Uh, this will definitely go up on the board and. Uh, I got plans for the sticker. So now for the moment itself, the Thompson. And I thought I wasn't really expecting a box like this. You know, I expected like you know a, a bag or you know something like that. But the box kind of surprised me. And so uh, we're gonna take this out. It has some nice tissue in here. You know, I have to admit, if you had seen my original reaction when I saw this thing, it would have been best, but I couldn't wait. I had to open it. I had to see it. And this thing was a lot bigger than what I thought it was. I mean, look at that. That is sweet. Number six, and that's the Thompson machine gun, and the detail on it is just amazing. Uh, he did color the, the the stock, the grip, and then uh, the, this grip. But he even included like the uh, the belt clips here where you, you put on a strap. Uh, there's the the bolt you slide back to the, engage the weapon. The uh, cartridge release, the cartridge release, uh, front rear sights, the little trigger. I mean, look at that! It's a tiny little trigger in there. You know, and uh, here's the other side. Again, just super detailed. And uh, you know, I I wonder, and I wish I had. Let me see if I can find one. Because, like I said, if you watch the videos, it doesn't look this big. They look a lot smaller. But you know, two point seven eight was it? Two thousand two point seven eight ounces. 
yes, 2.78. You know, that's a lot of silver. That's almost three ounces of silver. So, yeah, that, now that I see the weight of it, it doesn't really surprise me. Let's see. Let's see if... It is almost... It's almost five... It's a little over five inches long, so I mean that's a good sized gun. But yeah, I'm, I am uh, very impressed with it. I wish you could have heard my original, <laughs> my original reaction to seeing it because it was just like, oh my god, that thing's huge, you know. But uh, Scully, excellent work, man. I mean that's the thing about sand casting, you know, with molds, uh, you're kind of limited to what you know what what your carver or or. Uh, or whoever, or like your graphite and stuff like that, you just kind of pour it in there. But sand casting, if you can put it in the sand and it fits the, the mold box, you can pour it. It may not be the most easiest of things because these guys take, I believe Scully said, close to about, oh, what, eight, ten hours on them, you know, and, and they don't always pour right. You know, they have, there's sometimes where he has to do it again, you know, where things didn't quite make it down the mold and so there's a lot of work that goes into these things and it's just a beautiful piece so uh thank you scully i am i am just so happy to get that machine gun man i mean that is a piece uh when i saw it i had to have it and and thank you for making that come true buddy uh, it's it's going on the table. It's it's just a piece you can't store away, you know, in, in a safe somewhere. Although it should be, but uh, it's just too pretty to do that. It's got to be out for people to see. So this is definitely going up on the table. Uh, everyone, I hope you enjoyed it. I, I give Scully's Corner a look. Watch some of his videos. This is only one of many guns that he that he makes, uh, along with other great pieces that he pours. So uh, check him out. Uh, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and stack on my friends.